Hello, hello everyone, I am Darkness and welcome back to Final Fantasy Tactics, The War of the Lions. I decided that I should probably show you guys a little bit of the behind the scenes before we go on to that next little red dot. If they're red, it means that there's a, a, an event or a battle, and I know that's a battle where we meet somebody new. But, you guys should probably know how this kind of works. They got a party roster, we've got a lot of people in it. So, you can actually have them equipped with very many things. We have a job system, where there is a wheel of jobs, and more open as you level them up. For example, once the knight gets leveled up to, I believe, uh, I don't know. Okay, chemist has to be leveled up to level three, and I believe it unlocks white mage and black mage. Knight needs to be leveled up um, to unlock monk. Uh, Archer is leveled up for thief. I can't remember the exacts. There's, some of those are probably wrong. But there are like a bajillion, like 20 jobs in this game. So there are jobs that you can switch to that have different, you know, perks and all that jazz to them. Uh, different things they can equip, different strengths and weaknesses. Um, your bravery is about strength, your faith is about magic. Um, and finally, you have the abilities. Now, I've got everything, the equipment, under wraps pretty much over here, and, but I've got to do one more thing in the shop that you get to see that. But the abilities... Abilities are things that you actually get to put on your characters and uh, uh, help decide what they can and can't do. So you can learn them from the list. You actually have to play as the job and get job points by doing actions as the job to level it up. So this is, game is a little different in that there is no real way to... There's ways to get through leveling a bit faster by using things like the Squire's um, Focus or Tailwind. Tailwind's ROMs are only, but Focus. Even if you don't get to hit somebody or cast a spell, you can use Focus and you get 10 experience and however many job points, no matter what. So a lot of people get Focus and spam that, but that's as close as you get. You have to do things. There's no real easy way of getting through it in this game. Um, and you, to do that, if you want to go that method, you've got to put it as your main class or as a sub. Because metal is what it's called for him for Squire. Most people, it's called fundaments. Uh, but items, being able to use items is the chemist class, which I have equipped with ROMs right here. Art of War is knight and aim is archer. So this is a reaction ability. Something's happened to you and you get to act back. I have none because it's the start of the game. This is an automatic ability. It just is there, it happens, it helps. And finally, this is about movement. So something that happens when you move, after you move, during you move, during uh, your movement. Many times that's equipped here is the ability to move more spaces, but there's things like, uh, there are other things that'll come. Now, most of everyone I just already took care of, but I went ahead and left Alita without actually equipping items. And I didn't even see if if he's got anything learned for it. So chemist under here, he can use potions because he's got enough job points that he uh, bought it. Antidote, and that's it. So he can use a potion and an antidote. And as a squire, he can rush and chant. No, um, he can chant. Are you serious? He can already chant. Not you, Siri. Yes. I'm not to be frivolous. Oh, shut up. Phone. So anyway, that's a small breakdown. Hope it didn't bore you too much. Um, finally, I gotta go in the store, just because the outfitter. Uh, once I get in here, uh, you. I mean, you can buy stuff just straight up off the rack, and it's beginning of the game, so there's barely anything. But you can also go to the fitting room and hit optimize to see if there's anything more that they could have. It's the broadsword. I knew one of them didn't have a broadsword. I don't. I'll get her one, but I'm not gonna use her. Um. And, yeah. So, done. 400 gil. So, now that we got that finished, we're gonna go on. So, thank you so much for joining me. Hope you're liking it. Leave a like if you want to see more of this series. Really, and truly. So, we're allowed to have four people on the field of our characters. Delita will be on the field no matter what, so he takes up our fifth spot. So, let's go ahead and go Squire... Squire, male squires, and then let's get our female um, chemist. Let's go that. Because the heals uh, 
can help sometimes. You get teams of five usually, but at the beginning of the game or when you have guests and it's not a big, as big of a battle, um, they take away the fifth spot and give it to NPCs. So all of the early years, you don't get your fifth spot. But this is why we're watching this battle. Looks like th looks like this one's still alive. What do we do with him? What do you think we do with him? Right then. Your luck's run out, Knave. If ever you had any. Blast. One of the Order's patrols. The Corpse Brigade. And they have a hostage in their midst. Now I get to choose if I'm uh, a good person or a bad person with this one. Uh, I think he's still got to save the guy, but our first duty is to defeat the brigade or we must rescue their captive. Captive. Do less would be unbecoming of the men of the order. Protect Argeth. There, there are some people that I've played this game enough that I cannot... I, it's hard for me to hold back my contempt for their character. Reinforcements, and none too soon. See how it said 85% by the way, if you check that? He had, uh, guy had an 85% chance of being hit. Right, like right here, 100%. Ah, why every time I point it out it's 100%, I don't know, but... It's a pretty good point to make in this game, as um, those little things help you decide how far you can move, how far you can hit. Uh, we'll see more and more of it as as there's progression. But I gotta get over there fast. Um, and while I'm slow, oh, I can't. I didn't learn it yet. I was about to say I can. I had, don't have enough job points. I couldn't learn the 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 job that's um, unique to him, which is being able to speed things up. Yeah, he can defend also. The kitty cat. Okay, he can't move far enough to get to me. Sticks and stones will break your bones. It's proven in this game. You'll be tossing some stones. Now, I remember also this is when I, I mean, when I got this, I was in my phase of, um, like binging on video games a lot. Like, I, I would get stuck on one and like, play the crap out of it. Um, which was fine at the time, but it's something that I kind of miss. You know, um, there's a lot of times where I just can't sit down and, and binge on a game just because it's a it's a game, it's a new release, I want to play it, it was so good, the replay values that I played again. This game, and another game that's probably gonna pop up, Legend of Mana. Um, I play, Legend of Mana is open-ended. You can choose what characters to even interact with and how you go about beating the game. You can choose how to build your own world uh, that you inhabit as you play the game. And uh, it's very different and unique. And I played that one a lot of times because the different ways you play it determine, ah! 75% chance of hitting and he didn't hit. Uh, the way, the way you build your world and the way you interact with characters and how you decide to go about your days decide for you how the game goes along. And I used to binge on those kind of things because it was almost like, um, I love books. And these were almost like visual novels to me. Like these were, um, these were times where I would just simply be able to, to have something going on that visually is stimulating. But at the same time, it's my imagination got to run wild with this this story and this tale that is being weaved in front of me. And I got to just kind of try to imagine exactly what's going on. Please finish him off. Thank you. D 
See, they always try to swing around back, so they got a better chance of doing things like that, which hurts. And he's hiding in the corner because he doesn't want to die. He'll come back out if he's needed for like a last second kill type thing, but other than that, he's gonna he's gonna hide. And I just got behind to be able to hit better too. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. She can use first aid. Okay, here we go. We need to kill this guy. I can I I can always he, uh, raise him. All right. Maybe distract these guys. Well, oh, I can block their path. Either one of them hurt? Nope. Attacking him head on. Great. Now, as long as his turn comes up fast enough, I can get him back over there, kill the other guy near my chemist, and keep him healed. And see, it's like a chess game. It's, it's, it's trying to figure out all these... Yep, there we go. As long as he gets his kill in. Yep. He should be fine. And Delita will come out of hiding and decide to help me out here. Now, once they're like the last man standing or everybody is critical, um, they'll, the, the characters will come out of hiding. The enemies, chocobos are annoying. The first time you see me fight, fight a chocobo without being leveled up, I won't be happy. They have an ability. You'll see. But Argath is a a, a big time character in this uh, in this game. The plot thickens with saving him. Can I get over to this guy? Yes, I can. That's the answer. Oh yeah, I also have to go to this guy. Jeez, come on. Can everyone spread a little bit more, please? I was hoping everyone could just spread out more. I am just to level her up. I'm gonna I'm gonna spend the 50 gil to give her more experience and job points. See, 10 experience, 10 job points. They're not the easiest to come by at all times, so. Am I too high up to be able to make this happen? Nope! Got a long sword. I don't think you can do that with a dagger. Now, if this gets drawn out any longer, I'm gonna be trying to go for crystals to be able to level my guys up faster. But it should not be drawn out that long. Like this guy's dead. There we go. Now everybody goes. Okay, I said everybody goes. And I meant right after that, everybody goes after. What's his face? More experience. She got a job level, that's what I was hoping. Come on, bring it. Come on, scrub lord, I'm ripped. What what are the what what are you even doing, NPC? Are they are they trying to go ahead and get like a bait? You know what? This is something you can also do to get levels. I am going to smack the shit out of my own guy. Actually, I'm going to chant. It's his special ability of his, too. I'm gonna heal him by giving up. He gets 20 hit points, I have to give up 10 of mine. Yay, I didn't have to smack the shit out of him to do it. Cool. You're dead. You were so dead. Thank you for dying. Are you harmed? Argath says, I'll be fine. 
It is for the Marquis's safety, I feel. Fear. I already say Marquis. Is it Marquis? I, I don't know if he actually pronounced the rest of it. The Marquis? The Marquis El Elmdor de Limberry was here? The very same. And whom do I owe my gratitude? Gratitude. We are Knights Apprentice from the Academy at Gar Garland. We may be able to help you, but first I would hear more. Oh, and will we hear more? But the battle is won. We're gonna hear more. There is more to hear. My name is Argus, a knight in His Excellency the Marquis Elmdor de Limberry's household. A knight, you say? Well, truth be told, I am a knight apprentice, as are you, if I'm not far mistaken. A fellow knight in training, then. I am Ramza Biolv, and this is Delita Hyrule, my trusted friend. Biolv? You're not of the Biolvs of the Order of the Northern Sky, are you? What fantastic luck! A blessing in the midst of disaster! What? Get your hands off me! The order, the order can help me rescue the Marquis. It must! He is being held captive. They took him hostage, yes, but he still lives. We must act quickly if he is to remain so. Should he be killed, I will lose everything. Don't touch me, don't touch me! You simply must help me, please. I beg you. Calm yourself. Who's to say your Marquis is to be killed anyway? The corpse brigade would not take a man alive, save there were value in keeping him so. Of that you can be sure. There's little the three of us can do to help in any case. If the Marquis was taken hostage, Iagros will be in an uproar. You can be sure of that too. Then before all else, we report into Iagros. Are we agreed? Agreed. We'll start there. Now, how much time do I've got? I'm going to go ahead. There's a little something something here. I'll try to we'll get. So now he's Lord Dystar, uh, Beolv. I hear you were decorated, uh, I hear you were decorated for your first victory, Ramza. They sing your praise from on high. You do honor to our name, my brother, and to me. I'm, I'm glad, says Ramza. Oh, you would not seem it. I am, forgive me. Your words do more, uh, do me far more honor than I have done you. No dirt, no dirt, no doubt where it has already reached you. For the Marquis de Limberry's carriage was waylaid, and the Marquis taken. What have you a mind to do? I have already asked Zalbag to dispatch the squad in pursuit. These brigands must eventually come forth to demand ransom. That is, assuming the Marquis yet lives. I beg you, Lord B uh, Blue, uh, Bel Beolv. Wow. Lend me a hundred men, that I may hunt the whore sons down. Again, where you realize this is more of a, a mature mind game where he just called them whore sons. Yeah, yeah, that's an insult you can put in your pocket. Please, my lord, grant me means to avenge my fallen friends. May hap your ears fail you. I said that a squad is to be dispatched. You are not a man of Galeon. Leave her affairs to those of us who are. But my lord, do not assume to beg favors of me. Let me remind you, Argath, lest you forget your place. You are but another sword, not yet even knighted. The two of you will remain here at Iagris and serve among the castle guard. You needn't worry. Danger is not likely to visit these walls. Well, you say that, but <laughs> My own house was once respected as highly as House Beov, you know. At least, 
until my grandfather was captured during the war. He turned traitor, thinking to buy his freedom with the lives of his friends. But his freedom scarce outlived his honor. He was not a dozen paces out their gate when the dagger found his back. Killed by some common squire, no more a knight than I. One of the men he betrayed later escaped and spread word of his misdeeds. My lord father would have none of it, of course, but he was the only one. Our banner men deserted us, our reputation ruined. I suppose I had best remember my place. Your lord brother has no reason to lend ear to please from the likes of me. Teacher. Delita! Teetra! Alma! Zalbag! No one said Argath! I'm sad. Alma says, Ramza, you've come home. It's been some time, hasn't it, Zalbag? I heard about Garland. They say you made short work of those brigands. Now you've truly the right to call yourself a be uh, Beolv. Father would be proud. Thank you, Lord Brother. Ha! You certainly haven't changed. Gods forbid you show a bit of cheer on being praised. And you, Delita! You do not think word of your deeds escape our ears. Your sister's been so full of pride I quite feared she might burst. Worry not. My seams have held. I'm glad to see you looking so well, Delita. And I, you. Have you settled in at school? Yes, the others have all been quite kind to me. With that, we could speak at greater leisure, but there are duties that require my attendance. Rogues do not catch, catch themselves. I understand. Good luck. Oh, wait, 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 wait for it. We, we received a note of ransom from the corpse brigade. What? Something about it sits unwell with me. They are anarchists, to be sure, bent on bringing down the arist uh, aristocracy. But they fancy themselves righteous and prey only on the nobility and those in our employ. Would such as they truly kidnap the Marquis for what they for want of coin? Why wouldn't they? They've not but common footpads. He is so bigoted; it's not even funny. Argath is completely bigoted against anybody of low birth. One of the men I planted among them has not returned. I worry he may be caught up in something serious, but there are those who do not think some mere spy worth a search party's efforts. Where was he last known to be? A merchant city named Dorder in eastern Galeon. Guarding a castle grows dreadfully dull. Wouldn't you agree? That's where Zalbag is like, I'm gonna plant the seeds. Um, don't tell Dice Dark. He's kind of he's he's kind of uptight about things. Forgive us, Teacher. It seems we must be leaving sooner that we than we had planned. Don't worry about me. Just take care of yourself. I will. Mind your studies. I'll be back before you've even noticed I'm gone. Let's be on our way. Teacher puts on a brave face, but the truth is, not as honeyed as her words. What do you mean? She has a hard time of it at school. The others tease her for being lowborn. Forgive me, I shouldn't have said anything. I'm sure you have worries enough on your own. Teacher will be all right. I'm here to look after her. Then there is not to worry about, but mind your own limits. You can't be responsible for everything. Says the brother who never fails to do any and all that is expected of him. Don't lose sight of yourself, Ramza. You needn't let your life be ruled by the fact that you were born a Beolv. Now you're starting to sound like mother. <laughs> Ramza. My hair usually dances like this. 
So now we've got a new place that we can go, which is kind of cool. And we're going to go try to figure out what's going on with the ransom when it does not seem apparently that's the case of these people. The Corpse Brigade, who have captured uh, Marquis Limberry. Uh, I Is it Marquis or is it Marquise? I don't know. I want to drop the end of it just because it doesn't feel right, but I don't know. So, you can let me know in the comments whether I've been saying it wrong, but I'm gonna uh, sign off for right now, so thanks so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying. Hope my narration, even though it's not a bunch of character voices, I cannot, there's too much dialogue in this game for me to uh, try to do any character voices, otherwise I will shoot my voice so fast, it's not even funny. Thanks for watching, hope you're enjoying. And I hope to see you back here for the next one, really, really soon. Bye!